tell me in the comments section if you guys dig these glasses or not. They're prescription, but uh, I think they're pretty cool, but uh, let me know if you guys like them or not. Hello and welcome to the Skyball channel. Today, in a first of a kind video that I never thought would have happened in a long time, but it actually happened, I'm going to be reviewing a gaming chair. And first off, I wanna give a huge thanks to Cougar for sending this product over. It's always a joy whenever I review a product, but getting something huge as this, like right at my doorstep, and knowing it's a review product is a really huge joy to me. And I just wanna give a huge thanks to you guys for sending this gaming chair over. Now, I wanna give you guys a little analogy. When you think of gaming peripherals, they're definitely something you're gonna be using every single day. So you're gonna to wanna to put a good amount of money into those products. So whenever you think of getting a good gaming keyboard, that's because you're gonna be using it every single day. And if you're gonna be getting a good mouse, it's gotta be good because you're gonna be using it every single day. And same goes for like your monitor or even your mouse pad and desk. But did you ever think about investing in a good chair to sit on? Well, that is where this gaming chair comes into play. Because from over the use of using this gaming chair, if you haven't considered getting a gaming chair, I highly recommend you would. And actually throughout this review, I'm gonna be comparing it to my old office chair. So for you people who maybe still be using that supposedly nice office chair that you guys have been using for a long time, and you're maybe looking at getting a gaming chair, then definitely stay for this entire review. It's definitely gonna be worth it. And I think you guys are going to be pretty surprised with my opinions on this product. But anyways, let's get into the review. So where to begin with this gaming chair review? Well, check this out. Oh! So uh, this is something cool I wanted to show you guys because uh, this chair actually has a very good weight distribution. So like, I can literally like... <laughs> this chair will not flop over, which is kind of cool. Now I'm actually below 180 degrees, which seems a lot, but this is something cool I wanted to show you guys. and. Uh, so you won't ever tip over. Like I literally just let, I really pressed the lever and I went down all the way and I did not tip over. So that's something cool you guys should uh, check out with this chair. But anyways, on to the actual review. After using the Cougar Armor chair for a good two weeks, I can safely say that if you haven't invested in a good gaming chair yet, then you definitely should. And here's why. There's a reason why a lot of people use gaming chairs. And that's because they are very comfortable and they're just comfortable as hell and look pretty stylish for what you're paying for. The chair itself may not look like it's gonna have the same amount of padding as like some of the other expensive office chairs they may be considering buying, but I really do agree with the overall consensus that these gaming chairs really do feel like beds, but on a chair. In a way, these are really gaming chairs. Like they're literally meant for gaming because you could actually like legit just take a nap or even sleep in them. With the Cougar armor in specific for you fabric nerds, it's composed of PVC leather, which at first look looks like it's not that breathable, but it's actually very breathable, which is very nice for someone like me because I got some hairy ass legs and on my old chair, whenever it got hot in my room, I would usually leave like a little stain on my old chair from the sweat emitted from my legs. And so far with the Cougar armor, that has yet to happen, which is awesome. Now, upon first getting this product, I was a little bit baffled because the Skydival channel is usually known for building PCs, but not really known for building chairs. But regardless of my experience with chairs, this chair was extremely easy to assemble and it too took like about 30 minutes tops. Unboxing and assembling everything for the most part was fairly easy. There were a few spots assembling the chair where I had to do some finessing to get some stubborn screws in, but I eventually got them in. But one thing I'd like to point out is that I did have some difficulty when I was assembling this chair and that was when it came to assembling on the side plates that go into the chair, which should be assembled with the screw in a plastic snap-on, but I could only get the snap-on because the screw just wouldn't go in. And that's probably because the plastic plate didn't line up with the screw hole that was in the chair. So that was one problem that I ran into. And hopefully Cougar has this fixed once this model is in you know, full on production. And this may be because that I received an early version of this product. But on to my experience with the chair. And I would say that the experience with this has made my gaming experience experience just much better, especially when it comes to playing my favorite games like Planet Side 2 on those long nights. Over 2016, I made the jump peripheral rise to my first ever mechanical gaming keyboard, a proper optical gaming mouse, and a proper mouse pad. And for 2017, now I finally made the jump to my first ever gaming chair. And I would say out of all of the upgrades I've ever done to my gaming setup, the best upgrade would have had to have been probably the switch to the membrane to my mechanical gaming keyboard. But the second best upgrade is hands down 
moving from my old office chair to this gaming chair. Having this chair has made my gaming experience so much more enjoyable. And I'm not joking here, guys. I appreciate every moment that I'm on this chair because it really is that comfortable. It's got the right amount of plushiness along with firmness. And you may think that, you know, just because the neck pad and butt pad are on there and, you know, they're kind of attachable, so they're not really needed for the chair, but they are actually needed because they just complete the overall feel of the chair, especially the neck pad. It has made life so much better. And when it comes to these gaming chairs, I don't know how well like a $100 knockoff gaming chair would do compared to this, since I have seen some others out there that have this same sort of style and construction. But even with this Cougar Armors $250 price tag, even though it sounds expensive, I would say it's 100% worth it. And I would say, I don't really know how a 100 dollar gaming chair would do like as i said but i would say with the chair at the very least it'd be worth investing in something that is maybe a little bit more expensive so you get something that is solid and really comfortable and doesn't have any sort of setbacks due to its price and even if you were to compare this to like old people chairs like those old chairs or like those you know old chairs you find at like the living room of your grandparents house I guarantee you, your grandparents would get a better kick out of a chair like this versus their like marshmallow $500 recliner chair. So that's something I'm willing to bet with this gaming chair. But yes, in concluding up this review, if you haven't made the switch to a gaming chair, I would highly recommend it. I feel like it's something a ton of gamers overlook and just from using this chair, this is one of the best upgrades I've ever done for my gaming setup. And I really mean it when I say that you will really feel how comfortable this chair is. And the good thing is that a lot of gaming chair models are like this since they're very similar in construction, like as I said. But if you want something that's high quality and one that looks good, and uh, since some gaming chairs kind of, you know, sometimes look cheap or too good to be true, I'd recommend getting this Cougar Armor. I really don't see anything wrong with it unless you have a beef with the color orange. But anyway, so thank you guys so much for watching this chair review video. Make sure to like, favorite, subscribe, and all that. Tell me if you dig the glasses or not. But anyways, this is the Scarborough Channel signing out.